Okay. Let's see here. No, that's not that one. I'm just going to... Yeah. Hi everyone and welcome to Gathering of Light with the uh, Hot Hot with Ivan, that's me, and uh, lovely Maureen from Light Language Live. So we are so thrilled to have you here together with us and uh, we are doing a follow-up to the last time we met and uh, we were presenting healing in a slightly different form. We are kicking off the healing with a meditation and we are sliding into a light language presented by Maureen. And then we close the, the healing circle with the meditation to, to get back into our place. So I'm Eva and uh, I have on this page hot to hot and I'm also presenting interviews with people. And uh, I have this marvelous interview about light language with Maureen. So please go there and check it out. So it's so worth watching it. So Maureen, would you like to say something? <laughs> Hello everyone. And uh, Eva, thank you so much for this opportunity once again to join together. Um, it's so fun for me. And, uh, I, yeah, I am um, Maureen Moore with Light Language Life. And I am uh, an energetic, intuitive, and uh, light language teacher. And I assist others to connecting through the heart and working with, you know, core issues and releasing through forgiveness and, and uh, energy, energetic attunements, assistance, mm -hmm. and, um, and the host. You had a very beautiful oh. ceremony. I, I just need to say that. Uh, I was, was to, I was listening into that program you had the other day, the workshop. It was the womb awesome. healing workshop. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, good. So that's, that's that was my first one. <laughs> your first, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Pure healing. Pure healing. Oh, beautiful. I, I've been hearing uh, feedback, and it was a small group, but those that watch it also. And it was powerful and just such wonderful sharing from everyone. Um, and and then when I hear uh, friends that have watched it also could feel express that they feel energetic attunements and through the light language and and um, the words spoken. And I hold certain mudras with my hands as well. And and they've experienced just a lot coming through. And so I highly recommend this this is something that I was guided to do just through I do channel writing and one day spirit just came through and I had this whole guidance that you know based on my own multiple experiences regarding marriage different loss um and and womb we'll just call it womb healing wounding um there's so many aspects to that that I'm receiving that I'm really able to assist through the way I work with light language and my heart expansion, my connection to the divine feminine in so many ways, um, beauty and mother, uh, to just oh, assist others to oh, gently open their heart and open um, all stuff to just um, release and and then there's a whole, oh, and also I forgot the important part. I know this is a little off subject, but there is a powerful channel message that came through that provides such forgiveness to the mothers. I mean, it, I mean, what it does is, is, is um, really convey that, that you're honored and um, there is no reason for any blame or judgment. And uh, so it, that's for another day, but it was just to share that with the people that joined and, and with those that are listening. I know for myself, when I first read it, it was so uh, freeing. Mm. And, and um, so it'll be a message that I'm going to continue to work with. And, and then um, as I'm building my website here, I will be offering one-on-one -on -one, uh, sessions as well to work with any male or female 
that um, would like to work on this matter. I didn't intend to speak about that, and but I feel like I, I just I the think message it was out the because it's like yeah, divine guidance. I would call it. Yeah. 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 Uh, I didn't think that. Yeah. yeah. Well, I can see that that we have a topic for this uh, session. I, I actually thought earlier that I haven't given this meditation any any thoughts today. Mm -hmm. So that is also going to be very interesting to see what it leads. But then we have a topic building a bridge to peace. And I can see it's a red thread that's going through the work you have been doing. And um, because it will end up with you uh, listeners and, and everybody who participate in, in this healing modality that you have, that they will find this peace within themselves. So it's going to be interesting. So what we are going oh, to do, yeah, yeah sorry. Go ahead. I just wanted to say so within that guidance to work in that way, but all my work, it, it just was that I have a certain frequency and vibration that allows heart expansion as well as um, peace of mind, sort of, you know, uh, it, I'm working with mental patterns and mm -hmm. belief systems as well as um, the heart. And, and uh, just like, and I feel that it flows through for any subject matter that is um, the light is assisting with and so today uh just i wanted to for those that may be listening for the first time or and haven't heard light language there it's a series of um tones and sounds and language that assists to the body intuitively well i'm sorry your higher self intuitively responds in the most effective way to help your body um balance and align and it's the um you know, one language of from source that are able to tap into when the if they so choose and the time is right for their soul journey yeah there's a lot of energy in that too that comes oh, yeah. <laughs> when you're talking about it so i guess the session is already on even though we are sitting yeah. and speaking oh you she can also, yeah, for me, I start to swirl a little bit when I'm in the energies, and that usually starts pretty quickly. So, yes, I, I feel that too. Yeah. And uh, how we are going to do this? Well, we are going to start with a meditation, as I said, and uh, light, light language will be presented in the middle of that meditation. Um, so, shall we begin? Yeah. So, forever for whom that are here, please be comfortable. Just get in a comfort position. And if you are laying down, don't get too comfortable because you will probably fall asleep and you will gain from it. But the best experience is when you are somehow present anyway. So, just get comfortable, preferable on a chair, and put your feet into the ground or on top of the floor today. I want you to feel the floor or the ground underneath your feet. And I want you to feel your whole presence sitting here on that chair or on that spot that you are. I want you to feel yourself sitting in a very comfortable position and if it feels safe to do so please close your eyes and just let the being of yourself move inside of you draw your energy inside of yourself into a small tube of light that is centered in the middle of you and reaches from top to toe. So put your awareness into the middle of your core and just follow your own breath. Don't listen to anyone. Just follow your own breath. 
And for every breath that you are taking in, feel the oxygen filled with energy moving out in your body. And for every breath you exhale, see how the energies that have been stuck in your body is just flowing outside with that breath, just getting all cleared out from your body. Take a couple of breathings in and out here. And for every breath you are taking in and exhaling out, you will feel that your body is getting more heavy and heavy. And you will no longer sense the chair that you are sitting up on. You are your I am presence, and you are the soul, you are your soul. You are the light, you are the divine light. You are love. And you are free will. And you are a divine design. And with these words, A white light has slowly been coming down from your soul star and is moving its way down outside of your body. The creative light, the divine light. And imagine how the light folds every part of you, every energy layer around you, and how it closes in under your feet. And up under your feet like a pillow that you are placing your feet upon. And the light of God is moving slowly up through your feet, up through that beautiful center of light that you're drawn within you, your own essence and being place in the center of your body from top to toe and the light is moving upwards passing your root chakra moving up through your belly chakra up through your solar plexus and up to your heart When it comes to your heart chakra, the light will expand outside of you, out in your whole body. And you can feel how the light that you 
centered into a small channel is expanding and getting broader and broader. You can see the light slightly moving up, up from your heart chakra to your throat chakra. Moving up through your third chakra, your eye chakra. Moving up to your crown chakra. And moving up to that point above your head, your soul chakra, the seat of your higher self, your I am presence. And the light that is moving from your soul chakra down around your energy bodies and up through through your feet and up to the soul chakra again is filling your whole body and is moving slowly outside of your body and if you are drawing your awareness into your mind again Put all your awareness in your mind and drop some of that awareness into your heart. Shift focus into your heart. And with those two energy points, you're starting to feel a connection with us in a circle. You can sense that you are not alone. So if you're looking for your third eye chakra, you can see beings of light who has joined us sitting in circle with us and you might feel a slight pressure over your heart chakra or over your mind chakra and just shift your awareness and bring the focus either up or down so you get that balance and just breathe in and out and see how the light from yourself and from the other light beings around you slowly are closing in and merge together. We have this beautiful circle in the middle of us all. And if you look into that circle, you can see the light, the white light, slowly start to move, moving as white flames. moving like a bonfire right there in the center of our circle. And 
and they are saying that there are going to be a story to be told. Blockage to be solved. And healing that will be brought to you. While we are making room and space. For our Maureen to enter with her light language. And sing for the longer service. Oh, no, but no, 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 Concept that you're you'll definitely see more clearly with clarity that which you need to. You are worthy. You are loved. Say la ya, yo yo ya. I am the old guy. I am the ha. I am the old. I am. Your heart expands. It's the only Feeling the presence of my guy grandma, Lemurian mother. My Lemurian mother. Here recording us all. Pukosabone Bukashiene Alenya no no. Pukosha Yanaya no Bukoshi Yane Hinaya. They lay on the Kosha no Yananya. The balance and the alignment with all today. Continue. Keep release. Continue. 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 
to yourself. Self-love, 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 self-love. Release slack paradigms. <laughs> For the day we shine, we shine, we shine. <laughs> we always shine, but you are shining. Brighter. That weight of the world holds you down with so your Oh, no. He was alignment today, the guidance to align within all. Today we support and lift our hearts, all hearts. I just felt a lot of force through my hands. So. Brings that, fills that bridge to peace. Poshomone hayane hayane, acceptance of one's individual journey as it may not reflect your own. You are worthy regardless of whatever another person chooses to believe. It's your path. Consciousness. I like lifting, expanding this voice for that kushiana. We're all concerned to speak our truth because of what another believes. Yeah, <laughs> Ashane Kotone ripples with your vibration. Path not unfold as you expected, but release. Shane Oyanea Haya for there is 
way. They say na 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 connecting with your higher self. Koso mo koso mo ni padi ano koso niya na enhancing that connection. Koso po ko ni pagkanya kaliya. Koto pa kasi yun na kaliya na koto doon ni hasyan yun na yun na yun. O yun na yun. O yun mo yun na yun. Say yun na 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 yun. <laughs> so please stay in touch with your body sitting on the place where you're sitting right now and we will continue to let those energies and vibrations work within our safe circle because every word has a vibration and that vibration creates an image that can be visualized and be seen as a letter or a sign. And if you are drawing your awareness back up into your mind just for a little bit, Put your full attention into your mind and look through your inner eye into the bonfire of the white flame. You can see the energy moving. You can see the light forming itself to symbols into light codes and they are not placed in one position they are moving around it's like this huge container of vibrations that starts to expand towards ourselves and moving through our energy fields through our physical bodies and keeps growing a bit outside of our backs and we are all sitting in a giant ball of light vibrating with that special frequencies just for you and just for me and for everyone who's tuning in to this meditation so I want you all to take a really deep breath in and visualize how this vibrational codes moving through your body one more time and get back out into this giant ball of light when you exhale And this beautiful light is drawing itself back into the size of the bonfire with the white flames and slowly dissolves itself and we are starting to pull our own energy back towards ourselves releasing the touch with our friends in the circle
And the light is laying all around you and we are not pulling it inside of us anymore because it's so full of light already. So just let it be in this beautiful layer outside of yourself too. But your awareness, you can draw your awareness back up to your mind again up to your mind and be present of where you are this moment be present of the body that you are in your own body by starting to move and wiggle fingers and toes start slowly to move your body and feel the chair that you are sitting upon. Feel your feet, how they slowly feeling connected to the floor or earth underneath you. And take a last deep breath in. And exhale and release the contact with the rest of the group. And with that breath, we are sealing off our own energy. And keep it here, right where you are. And you will feel safe to open up your eyes again. And I say welcome back. And thank you for being here. Amen. I'm fully back as well, and I just okay. Let me see my honey. I well, I got the concept within as is about within. Of yourself. Oh, <laughs> just feeling that big hug from the mother. Like the concept that the, the grid work of the planet just it just light when we take care of ourselves in this way and nurture each other. Green is the energy is like Let it flow, let it flow, let it flow. that you need your nervous system wonderful work The moment mm -hmm. yeah, peace, that path to peace, the bridge to peace, because
<laughs> We're hugging. Okay, these are complete. Okay, so look at Shane. Yeah. Still basking in the energies. Oh. There's very present. <laughs> very present. Just feels like a big list, a warm hug. Yeah. Me and yeah. how I'm experiencing it. It's rock cold, nurturing energy. Just like a warm, cozy blanket. Yeah. So we are going to close this down and uh, we do have a chat room or should we say question and answers talk for those who want to join us on zoom we are going to end the live broadcasting and uh, stay here on zoom so if you want to be a part of that just uh, use the zoom link in the events description so feel free to join us and to the rest of you i said thank you for being here and thank you for once again maureen doing this beautiful healing work and uh, bless you all Bye. Um.